The Path Less Traveled. This song started off as Supposed to Live. It was a song that I wrote years ago when I was with Memphis Bell. And it, it was after our, we recorded our album, so I didn't make it on the first album. I recorded it for the second album uh, for Magdalene Blue, but there was something about it that wasn't quite right. And I was like, I really like this song. I don't want to just put it out there, just to put it out there. So we didn't put it on the second album and it kind of got put into a drawer. And then when we were looking at music, the songs for the third album, I it, like appeared out of nowhere like, oh yeah, supposed to live. But then I went back through the lyrics and I was like, this song doesn't resonate with me anymore. This is like the Mary from years ago. So a friend of mine encouraged me to, to try and rewrite some of the lyrics, which I've tried to do before, but I was like, it just never worked. Like. With other songs, it didn't fit with the rhythm, with the syllables, with what I wanted to say, and in the end I would just forget it, just let it go. But this song, I felt like it I deserved it. It deserved it. So I had a conversation with the song, and I said, if you want to be born, you need to collaborate here. So so I sat down, and for like a week or two, it was like every day, like just taking some time to like sit down and listen to the instrumental part of the song and play with you know, what is it I want to say? What What is true for me now? And it happened. It came out. And it, it talks about this last part of my life that I've been going through. And, and for the first song off the album, I wanted it to be... This song was a Memphis Belle, you know, creation. And so I, I called up all the old members of Memphis Belle and said, Hey, what do you guys think? Do you want to do this song? for the next Magdalene Blue album. And they're like, yes, of course, ah! And so this is like right in the middle of the pandemic, right? We've been a year into it now. And I was like, okay, how do we do this? So, you know, we got everybody together. It was a nice big um, rehearsal space, everyone with their masks on, you know, all the different distances. And we just jammed, you know, for a couple hours just with this one song. <laughs> um, and, and, and that's how it came out. <laughs>